What's going on Infinite Fam? Welcome back to another video. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, turn on your post notification bell, leave a positive comment down below, and you guys will get a what, babe? You guys will get a shout out in the next video. That is right. So guys, today, before we get into our juicy, juicy video, we actually have a sponsor we want to give a shout out to. So shout out to Exter Wallet. They are the largest smart wallet brand in the world. They were kind enough to send us over three things, which is a tracker card that you can put in your card holder or wallet. We have a red card holder and then a black wallet. So Janice is gonna actually help me unboxing these. We actually have not opened, we know what the tracker card looks like, but we don't know what these card holder and wallets look like. So Janice is gonna be opening up the red card holder while I open up the black wallet, and then we'll tell you guys more about the tracker and how it works. All right, so we're gonna be opening up the black wallet. Guys, the packaging is freaking beautiful. Look how it's prepared in there. You got the name on it, it's very nice. And I love the fact that it's actually like black case with like the black, shiny gloss i guess letters and whatnot is very sleek i love that so when you open up the wallet this is actually very fire i think i'm actually going to switch to this for my daily wallet mm -hmm. so this is what it looks like guys it's black leather it has a strap right here and then i don't know if you guys can see in there there's like a bunch of like little cards that's where you would put all your credit cards your license so on and so forth also your tracker card if you're going to use it and then there's a nice little pocket back here as well that you can stick whatever you want in there i probably put my license in there just because it's easy access then there's like another flap right here that you can put more cards Cards, whatever you want literally this is this is actually really nice I really like this all right babe so now that I showed them the black wallet do you want to show them the red card holder sure all right so I'm about to open the red one Ooh, yes. oh yes. hold up hold up I think I might want that no 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 this one's mine that's freaking fire oh that's so fire what is that like aluminum I don't know. Yeah, I think so. That's freaking fire. Guys, my card holder right now is falling apart. Ask Isaiah. And honestly, I love that it has a tracking. Nah, you're giving me that. <laughs> nah, that's mine. They really fire. I love that color. This is so cool. It's like so futuristic. Look. Yeah, that's really cool. Just like the other one, that's where you can stick your cards and all that. This is like so futuristic. It's I'm very like obsessed. Yeah, it's like really sleek too. That's freaking fire. Ah! Yeah. Fit in my small purse. Perfect. Yeah, we're gonna fight for that one. No, we're not because it's mine. All right guys So now let me tell you guys about the tracker card. So here we have the tracker card again Very sleek very stylish. I really like how all this stuff looks So then when you slide it out right here This is what you're gonna be inserting in your card holder or wallet. It's very sleek It's like it's not even there when you insert it and basically how it works is that you download the app on your phone You hook everything up through a setup. It's very easy very self-explanatory and once everything is already hooked up You will then have the ability to track your card holder or wallet and also also, they actually include the instructions right here when you take out the card holder tracker. So again, shout out to Exter Wallet. This is actually very, very fire. If anything, you're going to need this the most because you're always losing your wallet. I know. <laughs> you're actually going to benefit off of this way more. <laughs> it's going to make me feel so much safer knowing that I have that tracker. Shout out to Exter Wallet again. Thank you so much for sending these goodies over. And now on to today's video. One last thing, guys, I forgot to mention. Don't forget to use the link down below. You guys will get an additional discount on top of the Father's Day sale that they currently have going on. Guys, seriously, go and get yourself a wallet because I just set mine up and this thing is fire. Like, that that's fire. Go and get yourself a wallet. All right, for the fam, so now on to today's video. I'm going to be asking Isaiah the most intense questions that he has ever been asked before by me. So are you ready? I'm ready. I look just... at him. He already sweating. Look, look, look. No, no, I just got out the shower. Mm -hmm. My hair's still wet. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, my. Ask your questions, bro. I want to go to sleep. They're probably not even that crazy. All right, guys. So uh, you wanted to ask these questions. I took it from Instagram. So here we go. If another female asks to rub your body for $4 million, would you allow her to do so? Would you get mad if I said yes? That No, 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 no. You answer the question. Would you get mad if I said yes though? Because think about it. You answer the question. What do you mean rub? Like, like literally just like rub, like feel me, like touch me? Like. Bro, for $4 million, I'm taking it. And then I, if, listen, I'll give you $2 million just to get over it. Okay. Yo, yeah. and you'll take it, right? Yeah, $4 million, you're freaking crazy. Of course I'll take it. <laughs> She's not doing anything to me. All right, next question. If I passed away, how long would it take you to move on? See, that's hard to answer. I really don't know. I don't, it definitely would not be quick. I would probably be single for a couple of years, to be honest. So you're gonna move on? I don't know. I can't answer that question. I'm not gonna say no. I'm not gonna say you yes. You say you're gonna be single for a couple of years. That means you're gonna move on. How dare you? I'm not saying. I'm just saying. I'm gonna like, haunt you and oh your girlfriend. I'm gonna smack her while she's see, sleeping. See, here we go, man. Here <laughs> we go. Here we go. The answer to your question is I don't know because I hope that day never comes. I hope not. But mm. I know for sure I'd be mm. single 
for a long time before, if I ever moved on before I found another person, I'd be single for a really long time. That's my honest answer. I'm gonna haunt you. Please do, because I'd want you back. If you had to pick one, booty or boobies, what would it be? I'm a booty guy. Really? I love booty. So if thing, I chop my tetas off, you'll be happy? I wouldn't be happy. I'm, I was just about to say, thank God you have both. I get the best of both worlds. And you're over here talking about chopping them off. <laughs> but I prefer the booty. Yes, I'm a booty type of guy. Hmm. So if I had no booty, you still love me? Of course I'd still love you. Aw, you lying. You still have a booty to mess with. <laughs> I just like your booty now. I'm used to your booty size right now. I like mm. that. Okay, alright. Did you ever do nasty things while I was gone? What do you mean? Like choke the chicken type thing? What? You mean like choking the chicken? Like, you know, like pulling the old jackhammer? Like, I've never heard of that before. Choking the chicken? You talking about the bottle of lotion? You talking mm. about like that type of thing when you're not home? Yes. No, I haven't. Because mm. I feel like it makes me enjoy when we have, you know, nasty time I feel like it makes me enjoy it a whole lot more because I waited okay, okay it's like a build-up when we were in the talking stage were you talking to other girls no I wasn't no honest honest to God I was not no because my thing is when I'm talking to someone I'm giving them 100% of my time and my effort because I'm trying really hard to basically win you over so I don't have time to be messing with any other girls if I'm like focused on like the main one that I want, which is, is you. Why are you lying? How? You lying! How? Mm. You trying to start something? You see, this how is how argument starts. Start? This is how, how argument starts. Girls, mm. they like to just bring stuff up and make stuff. They they concoct this crazy potion and they just throw it out there. Oh yeah. And, and you, see, see, it's working. You see? So you wasn't still with your ex when you tried to talk to me? I don't count. Oh, that doesn't count. That doesn't count. Yeah, See, that don't count. Don't no, call me crazy because you no, know. No, but true. listen, listen, right? I'm talking to you. I wasn't talking to any other girls. I wasn't flirting with any other girls. It was like you. You had 100% of my time and my effort. And that's why me and my ex didn't work out. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how else to explain it to you. Oh, you such a. Oh, you find loopholes in every question. I should be a lawyer. Gosh. If I gave you the hall pass, what celebrity would you hook up with? Or would you hook up with a celebrity? See, my, my go-to answer was going to be Vanessa Hudgens, but I feel like she's being a little weird right now. <laughs> she's she acting a little weird. So I'm going to have to go with my backup. I'm going to say Ariana Grande. Ariana Grande. Ariana she's your backup, but you don't even know how to say her name properly? Ariana, Ariana, Oriana. Wow, but the other day, he was sitting here like, mm, she's kind of like mainstream now. Like, there's, there's nothing special about her anymore. She's still attractive to me. It's still a celebrity oh, crush. Oh, okay, she's yeah. She's still a celebrity crush. Make up your mind. Which one is it? I'm going with Vanessa Hudgens. She's just weird, though. She's, oh, she's, now you're she's, going with Vanessa she's Hudgens. Being little, she's being a little weird. All right, final answer. Final answer. Vanessa Hudgens. That's it. Final answer. Oh, yeah? If she doesn't work out, then Ariana Grande. Ariana. Oriana. Have you ever gotten caught watching XXX videos? I feel, see, it's hard because I was in the middle of it and <laughs> my mom walked in and I don't know if she caught me because I played it off so well. Nah. -uh. But it, it was a little awkward. So I feel like she knew, she just didn't say anything and she just walked out. And so it was when dead. was this? How old were you? Shit, like 12. But I feel like we, we after that we never talked about it. We just she didn't ask me like were you just you know and then I yeah, we never talked about it. So if she assumes this to this day that I was then she's right. But if she had she's clueless then she, if she's clueless then better for me. But now that she watched this, was you doing? What do you mean? Watching it? I don't remember to be honest. I really don't. I don't remember if I was watching anything. You're nasty. I'm pretty. I probably was. Ew, you I don't know, bro. I don't remember. I don't remember. It was years ago. We're talking like 10, 11 years ago. Mm -hmm. Next question. I'm getting hot. All right. Next question is, would you ever get my name tatted on you? No. <laughs> I don't believe in tatting someone else's name on you. Your significant other, I don't believe in tatting them on you. I get your initial, like a, like a little J somewhere. That's about So it. that way he can cover it up if everything goes wrong. Absolutely. Because anything <laughs> can happen and who knows, one day you might break up with me. You might get tired of my shit. I don't know. Mm, yeah, the time has come. So, Gotta go. honestly, then that's where the J, <laughs> would, the J would turn into all of a sudden like an L or an O or something. And it means Who's L? 
freaking know. Loser, you. Who's uh, Olivia? Who's Olivia? Oriana? Oriana, that's what it is. Oriana, there we go. Would you let me sleep with another guy if it meant to save your life? No, just kill me. <laughs> I wouldn't want you at that point. I'm dead serious. If you sleep with another guy, I don't care if it's to save my life. I, I, at that point, I don't want it. Like, now, what if, like, we break up, right? And then I end up sleeping with someone else, and you end up sleeping with someone else, and then... Well, we end up getting back together? Yep. No, that's different. Mm. That's different. We, we just... Mm -hmm. We took a break, basically, I guess. If that's what you want to call it. Mm. Alright, guys. So, this is my last question, and it's... Have you thought about other girls while we did the nasty? Yeah, you better not. No, I'm so focused on like... Baker. What? What? I'm so focused <laughs> on like what I'm like touching and what I'm feeling and just all of the emotions that are going through my ocean, body right now. That's... Ocean, I'm feeling ocean, everything. The ocean. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, I'm so focused on like what's going on in the moment. My, I don't have time to process anything else. So the answer to that question is no. Alright. That's it? That's it. All right, I'm not gonna lie. Maybe I would say maybe like three of those questions got me a little, a little like a little hot. Like I was trying my best to hide it though. So comment down below which one do you guys think I'm talking about. Mm-hmm. Right. I don't know. I feel like his he answered these a little too safely. I'm giving you my honest to god answer. I don't know what you want me. You want me to lie? You want me to spark something up? You, you want, want me to spark something up? You want me to spark up an argument or something? You want me to I don't know what to tell you. Anyway, guys, if you guys want to see her in the hot seat and you want me to ask her some crazy intense questions, just comment down below and also DM me the questions that you want me to ask. We're done, right? Mm -hmm. I go to sleep now? Yes. All right, guys. So if you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure you guys smash that thumbs up button. Comment down below, Team Isaiah. Why? Wow, this is not a prank. What you talking about, Team Isaiah? I don't care. Comment down, Team Isaiah. All right, comment down, Team Janice, because oh, Team Janice is the best team. That's our period. <laughs> Anyway, if you guys want to post a notification shout out, all you guys got to do is like, comment, share, and subscribe. Today's post notification shout out goes out to Henry Meyer. Shout out to you, bro. Thank you so much for having your post notifications turned on. And like I said, like, comment, share, subscribe, turn the post notification bell on, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Love you, Infinite Fan.